What's going on YouTube? This is AP iPhone Help. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get a 3D look on your iPhone 4 and iPod Touch. This 3D look is just going to be affecting your home screen and you have to be jailbroken in order to do this. I will be showing you guys a step-by-step -step instructions on how to do this. So let's just get into it. The first thing I'm going to show you guys is what it actually looks like and how it works. So if you look on here, I'm going to tilt it like this. And you guys can kind of actually see here, um, it actually really does look like it's 3D. So it looks pretty legit even on the camera. I know you can't really see it that well on the camera. But it does look actually really legit. So let's see how to do it. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go into Cydia and then you're going to wait for Cydia to load up. Now like I said you guys must be jailbroken to do this. Uh, of, the, of course that's how you get Cydia by jailbreaking it. So once Cydia is all loaded up you're going to go down here to manage right there. You're going to go to sources. You're going to go up here to the edit tab and you're going to click over here Oops, sorry, my camera's not focusing. Add. Then you're going to type in this source, which I will put right there. And then you're going to add the source. Now, since I already have it, I'm just going to click Cancel. Done. Now, when it's added, once it's added, you're going to go into the source. And the source is rptree.ch repository. It's a repo. You're going to click on that and there's two apps in here. One is called Activator and one is called Deep End. You're going to want to click Deep End. Deep End is the tweak that allows you to get the 3D look. So what you're going to do is you're going to go up here and yours will say Install and you will Confirm. Once you do that, you will reset your springboard. Now, I already have mine installed, so I'm not going to mess with that. Once your springboard is reset, you will go into here and it will automatically look just like it's 3D but to get a better 3D look you're going to go into your settings and if you go down all the way right there deep end there's already a deep end setting so now if I zoom in a little bit put a little bit more pitch it'll be a little bit better looking 3D there we go, that looks really 3D, doesn't it? But actually, in all, what it's doing is it's moving your wallpaper. And that's it. Alright, YouTube, I hope you guys learned something today. Uh, especially how to make your home screen look more 3D. There will be more 3D apps coming here soon. I know of one that I'm going to get here as soon as I can get it for free. And I will do an app review right away, right away and show you guys how to do it. But I hope you guys learned how to make your, uh, your home screen look 3D. If you have any questions, please leave a comment down below. Any problems, any questions, uh, please do that and I will definitely get back to you. I'm pretty good about getting back to all my viewers. So just leave a comment down below if you have any questions or anything like that. Please hit that yellow subscribe button up top. It helps my channel grow and it also helps me make videos, more videos for you guys to watch. And thanks for watching. Peace. Thank you.